different artists were dropping some projects and stuff like this, you know, even though we're in a pandemic. So, you know, I'm going to break mine down, kind of how, you know, it was in no particular order, but now since you kind of put yours in order, I'm going to throw mine in order, try to. So, okay. number five, I got with that, that Currency, the Collection mm -hmm. Agency, that was a dope album, man. He dropped yes. eight albums this year, man. It's crazy. I don't know how he keep crazy. up with that. I don't know how he keep putting out this dope music, but he somehow he does. You know, then yeah. again, I had Jim Jones at Fraud Department. That went hard for sure. That was a hard yeah. one. That was a hard one. Uh, and then I got Money Bag, yo, with the Gangsta Pain. You know, I had to represent for the South. You know, that was yeah. a dope album. You had it on <laughs> yeah. your list. Uh, yeah. And then, you know, a sneak attack one that you probably didn't really rock with was Big 30, man. That Big 30 album, you know what I'm saying? That was a really I, dope one, bro. I, Big 30. I remember you hey, talking about Big 30. Hey, yeah, Big 30. With, hey, and the thing is, he has <laughs> dropped, you know, right around the same time with uh, Ye and uh, Drake and all that. And for me, that one cut through, you know what I'm saying? It went hard, you know, even though we had the back and forth with Drake and, and Ye with their albums and rollouts and all that different stuff. But I just felt like that Big 30 album, was it went hard. And then, you know, I got my top one, bro, my – that Nas King Disease too, bro. Ah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. that King Disease, yeah. man. You know that King Disease went hard, bro. Like you know yeah, him yeah. working with Hit Boy. Somehow they got they they able to make magic magic together, man. They them boys kind of get together and they lock in together, and they can produce yeah. some good music. You know one of the biggest things I've always kind of griped about, and most people gripe about when it comes to Nas, is with his beat picking. You yeah. know with him being so yeah. lyrical, he feel like he can rap on any beat, no matter what it sound like. And for him yeah. to lock in with Hit Boy, you know Hit Boy kind of you know laid out a nice little game plan. It wasn't a lot of heavy 808s on it, and it kind of real, and he just kind of laced those beats, and man, and, and Nas kind of did his thing on it. And then I just want to drop yeah. one just little bonus album on you, man, that, that right, Pooh Shice and Sice season, man. That, you know what I'm saying? That Pooh Shice <laughs> well, I, I heard Pooh Shice. I, you know, I never, see the last, the couple guys you said was, uh, uh, when you said Big 30, yeah. and uh, Pooh Shice, I, I, I'm not real familiar with their with they music, but I, I do hear, I do hear a lot about them, so I gotta, I gotta, uh, I really got to check, check them out, man. I yeah, check yeah. Them out. So, them my, them my top five albums with the bonus album. Even though Shice is kind of locked up right now, he's not able to capitalize on, you know, a lot of that, that album. That he, yeah, he got locked up, and he's not able to capitalize on the album he dropped. But man. I really like that, that Pooh Shice album. So, them my top five albums. So, 